Hello, and welcome to Magnolia Academy. We can use the Magnolia Travels demo to get an overview of content authoring with a specific use case. This project illustrates how you can use pages and custom apps to manage your content. Content is managed in Admin Central, our web-based admin interface. Let's log in as a user with the editor role. Eric, the editor, and password is Eric. First, an overview of the three apps we'll be using. The Pages app. Every project contains a hierarchy or tree of website pages. Tour Categories app. A custom content app used to manage the destinations and tour type categories. It's based on the stock Categories app. And the Tours app. A custom content app to manage the tours themselves. First we'll look at managing content in a page, and then we'll look at managing content in the content apps. Let's edit the contact page in the travel site. Double click on the page. Clicking on the main text of the page, a text and image bar will appear. Text and image is a standard component provided by Magnolia Templating Essentials, MTE. Click on the edit icon, change some text, get in touch, and save changes. And the content is updated. Now let's look at editing a custom component. The travel demo adds custom components specifically for working with tours and tour categories. So we close the contact page and edit the home travel page. Click on the which tour type are you? A tour type teaser row bar will appear. This is a custom component. Again, click on the edit icon to open the dialog of the component. In the tour types field, we see that three different tour types are linked. So let's remove the cultural tour type and click the add button, click select new. And now we can choose which tour type we want to include. Save changes. And now we can see that culture has been removed and family has been added. So we ensure that the travel page is selected and we click add page. Let's create a fact. A site can define page template availability, which determines which page templates are available. We'll choose travel standard. Then we see our new page, and we can double-click to edit it. Notice that FAQ has been added to our top navigation. We can click the plus for a new main component. Choose text and image. And enter a little content. Now we can see the new content in our page, and if we preview the website, we see that we now have the fact page, and it displays our content. Now let's look at managing content from a content app. I'll close the Pages app. Content apps are useful for managing the things your website is about, tours, departments, affiliates, cars, etc. The content is easier and faster to work with than in the Pages app because there's just one dialog per item, no page layout, areas, and components. Content apps encourage clean reuse of content across the website. The content is entered once in the content app and used in pages throughout the website. So let's add a tour category. 
we open the app, open the tour types folder, select the tour types folder, and click add category. Let's make it about volunteer. You can add an image and let's actually upload a new image and put it in the tour types directory. And we'll choose that one. And then for the icon, I'll just use one of the icons that already exists. You can see that creating a content item is very easy because it's just one dialog. Here's our new content item. And if we take a look at the website and tours, now that we see that the website has automatically adapted and created this new tour type. Now let's take a look at editing a tour. For example, let's add it to our volunteer page. So I'll close the tour categories app, open the tours app, open the Magnolia Travels directory, and let's just edit the Vietnam tour. You can see that the Tours content app is just like the Tour Categories content app. It had the list of items, and now we're editing one of the items in a dialog. And if we go down to the Tour Types rows, let's just take it out of these Tour Types, and we'll add a Tour Type, and here's our new Volunteer Tour Type and save the changes. So we've just edited a content item. And now if we go to the website and refresh our page, we see that Vietnam is added to our featured volunteer tours. And if we visit the Vietnam page, the tour type is now volunteer. So that's a very quick overview of editing content on pages and within content apps and the differences.